And welcome to ETF Edge, your go-to place for everything exchange-traded funds. Confused about thematic investing? You like investing in clean tech, cybersecurity, cloud computing, robotics, but not sure which ones to own or how much to allocate to each of them? Let me help you. I'm your host, Bob Pisani. Let's talk to Christian Magoon, CEO of Amplify ETFs, who just launched the Amplify Thematic All-Stars ETF. MVPS is the symbol. It focuses on the consensus of ETF investors who are buying thematic ETFs. Also joining us, Jay Jacobs, right here next to me at the New York Stock Exchange, head of research and strategies at Thematic Tech Leader Global X. Christian, we have been talking about thematic tech investing for a few years now. This is an attempt to put all the hot thematic stocks into a single ETF. Describe to us what's in this ETF, how you figured out what goes in it, and is there really a compelling need for an ETF that tracks these most popular thematic stocks? Yeah, sure thing. So there's about 140 thematic ETFs out in the marketplace today here in the U.S. They own about 3,200 different stocks. So it can be very confusing to understand, you know, what thematic ETF do I buy? How do I avoid non-pure play stocks? How often should I rebalance? Uh, MVPs is an ETF that is simply uh, looks at uh, about 160 companies out in the marketplace that are the most widely owned by the thematic ETFs across the gamut. Everything from disruptive technology to sustainability to fintech to the evolving consumer. And this is, uh, uh, these stocks are uh, rebalanced every month uh, based off ETF ownership data. So the thought is this is almost like crowdsourcing a thematic core portfolio allocation from some of the smartest investors in the world, the ETF marketplace, and what they believe are the most valuable stocks and themes to have exposure to. Now, you decided on, on seven themes here, and this seems to cover all of the right bases here. Disruptive technology, evolving consumer, fintech, healthcare innovation, industrial revolution, sustainability, and multi-theme. Does this cover all the bases for you? I mean, is there, is there a split here? Are they equal weighted, or does it, is it literally just a crowdsourcing situation? Yeah, so ETF Action is the index provider, and what they've done is they, they've sorted all 140 thematic ETFs into one of these seven buckets. And then these uh, represent the basically the ownership of these themes by the ETF marketplace. And then ETF Action goes and looks at the actual ownership of the underlying stocks within these themes. Some of these stocks, like an NVIDIA or Tesla, may actually own by, be owned by multiple themes. So they do an ownership uh, adjustment uh, for some of these stocks. No stock can be more than 5% of the index or the ETF. Uh, and that's really how this 160 uh, stock portfolio uh, is put together. And it allows you to have exposure to all the different themes. And as you know, you know, just owning all the themes is important because if you miss uh, some of the best days in an individual theme, you may never get that back. So MVPs gives you a chance to really own all these themes and refresh that portfolio monthly based off ETF ownership data.